It's a wonderful thing to give OBI dentistry to someone. As I say, give people their lives back. And some people, you truly give their lives back to them. I never realized what dentistry can offer until I was introduced to OBI. Thinking, wow, I think I have discovered the path that I want to take. I went home and told my wife, I said, you know, I said, Carol, I said, you know, I believe I've found what I'm looking for. OBI, for the first time, I saw something that gave a set of principles based off of sound, biological, healthy people. I feel that one of the most important things that OVI bring to us is the capacity of make a good diagnosis. Prior to this, I could patch and repair and fix, you know, whatever was hurting or whatever was broken, and that's a great service. But now we can go beyond that. I can explain to my patients, you know, I can tell you why this is breaking. I can tell you why you're having a problem. I can tell you how to correct this so you don't have these problems repeatedly over and over again. With OBI, it has given me the confidence to be able to diagnose and at least know why things are wearing down. In my case, OBI has basically given me the answers that I was looking for in dentistry as to why was some of my work failing. You and I as dentists have spent our entire career studying disease, all about what's wrong. We never studied what was right and what was healthy. I'm thrilled. <laughs> I have a smile I, I didn't have before. <laughs> what was beautiful to me about bioesthetic dentistry was that they were looking at healthy individuals who had no wear, no joint pain, no headaches, all of the components, what, what components were there. And studying that and, and going from that point where you are not reacting, you are looking preventatively at this patient now saying, we want to create health and moving this patient from where they currently are to a health using the bioesthetic principles. And, and I've always had a, a desire to have nice teeth. I, I didn't have nice teeth as a child. And the gift that they give as a, as a dentist to me, as I said, I didn't have much pain. But the gift I've gotten has been more than just pretty teeth. It's been, it gives you confidence and confidence to smile and it just makes you overall happier which brings people to you even more than they were before and it's, it's, it makes you feel closer to people. It's been great. It's been a wonderful gift I've been given. Well, I got to say it's the most remarkable thing and to be here today and to see what's going on and to see all the other people and to witness an 85 year old lady who did this and to see the change in her and how it's obviously going to change the remainder of her life. I, I can't see why anyone who have had the same kinds of experiences that I have or have problems in their mouth uh, wouldn't go after this, uh, seek this out as, a, as a, a solution. And I don't think age really has anything to do with it. It's a, a matter of the quality of your life. Uh, I would recommend it to anybody, no matter what your age. Systems thinking is about studying the parts. But you can't study a system by, by learning about the parts. You have to study a system as a system. And you have to look at the whole picture at the same time always. And so biosetic dentistry is something that requires systems thinking. So you can't just look at one thing. 
it's like trying to play chess with you know tunnel vision. Not going to work. You have to see the whole board, and you have to see the moves on down 10, 12 in advance, uh, which is very difficult. But very, very exciting, challenging. And uh, prior to seeing this lecture, I was kind of the point in my career where I was really deciding that I needed to follow some discipline in dentistry. As I was uh, sitting in the lecture, I began to see something that uh, truly amazed me. Not only was the before and after pictures an amazing cosmetic transformation for these patients, but also um, I saw changes in the people's faces, their eyes, the way they held their heads, um, symptoms that they had been plagued with for years completely disappear. And I thought to myself, wow, um, I didn't realize that we could do this for people in dentistry. And of all the other disciplines that I had researched and studying, um, I did, did not see these kind of changes take place. Um, I look at myself as really the, I'm very passionate about dentistry. Um, I really want to do what's best for the patient. Um, I do not want to do any harm. I want to provide a great service. I want to improve patients the way they look, the way they um, can function, their comfort level. And I never realized what dentistry can offer until I was introduced to OBI. From a personal standpoint, I've, I've had the practice that I've wanted. I mean, as far as patient care and, and treating people in, 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 a, in what I consider a very humane way, in a very s slow practice kind of a way. Um, but I lack the, the disciplines to move forward into more of a comprehensive type care. And so OBI has brought me in contact with people who are interested in the same values and, and in the same things as far as uh, comprehensive care. It has also brought me to a level of discipline that I uh, never thought I'd be able to achieve in my lifetime. It always just has always looked too scary, you know, to go there. To own the knowledge of how the mouth works and to own a philosophy that you can count on that will work because it works time and time again. Uh, what a wonderful feeling it is to, to think of yourself as a doctor.